Untreated sore throats, skin infections, aside malformation of the kidney are leading causes of kidney problems among children. Excessive intake of herbal medicine by children also results in kidney diseases. Over the past 10 years, cases of kidney conditions have continued to rise with many parents finding it difficult to cater for their children. Head of Pediatric Nephrology Unit, Professor Samson Entry explains some parents abandon their children to die. No parent is prepared to spend that amount of money on the child when he can go and have pleasure and have another child. You understand? But for the adult, if they, told, they tell you you are going to die, you sell everything and put yourself on dialysis. The pediatric nephrology unit of the hospital is currently full with children across the northern sector of the country seeking help. Many are in pain as parents look on helplessly. Parents whose wards are diagnosed with the condition at late stages spend at least 900 cities on dialysis alone since they are not covered by the National Health Insurance Scheme. Those with acute conditions are covered under the NHIS. Here are some parents whose wards have been diagnosed with the condition. She says, the medicine prescribed for the children are very expensive, that we are unable to buy them. That honestly, when they told me it was genetic, I was a bit scared because I don't have it. I, as a parent, as a father, don't have that disease. So basically, when they said it was genetic, I was wondering if I don't have it, how come you know my child has got it? Professor Entry is calling on the government to stop the avoidable death by absorbing the cost involved in transplant. General kidney disease, we are seeing about 150 in a year, but the end stage, the terminal one, we are seeing 40 children are dying here only in Kompanochi. And we don't think I'm allowed this to continue. Just like certain diseases like cervical cancer and breast cancer and uh, cancer generally uh, are, are, are been taken off by the health insurance and uh, they don't pay any treatment for it. We are saying that children who get kidney disease, terminal kidney disease, government must come to our aid and absorb it completely from other um, uh, budget line. Now, this is a budget for treatment of children with kidney disease in Ghana. No child with kidney disease will pay anything, or the health insurance is made to absorb it. That's what we are saying. As an interim measure, an association of parents and professionals in the treatment of kidney conditions in children have been formed to help raise funds for the purpose. For Joy News, Nanaya Ojima reporting.